It marks day one of the Lunar New Year, the year of the rabbit. Over 2 million people across the globe celebrate this holiday each year. And downtown Summerlin has had their very own celebration. That's where we find Kay McCabe tonight with more on that. Hey there, Kay. Hey, Joe. Yeah, the parade actually just wrapped up and I just heard Gina talking about these crazy winds, but let me tell you that did not stop hundreds of people of coming out here to downtown downtown Summerlin to celebrate this Lunar New Year. There's lots of we're going to show you some of the performances earlier. If you weren't able to make the parade, we're showing you that right now. Lots of great performances from beautiful amounts of people. I was just speaking to a woman, Shirley. She was here watching the parade. She said coming here isn't an option. Her family celebrates this New Year every year. It's a tradition of their of theirs. And as many of you know, this comes on the heels of a mass shooting in Monterey Park, California that left 10 dead last night at a Lunar New Year celebration. Shirley shares her thoughts and condolences on it all. Well, being a Chinese person, you know, it's good to, you know, bring awareness because, you know, the next generation, they can lose the the traditions and everything, you know, we just expose him and everything. So it'll be, it'll be like, it's hard for people to go out now and celebrate things like this. It's just sad for, you know, people want to just stay inside now and not, not attend parades like. Now coming up tonight at 11 here on KTNV, more from the celebration that happened right here in downtown Summerlin for the 2023 Lunar New Year. I'll send it back to you, Joe.